search continues for a driver after a Lorraine teenager who is walking his girlfriend home is killed in a hit and run. It happened last night in West 23rd Street in Lorraine. That's where Kristen Vogt joins us now live. And Kristen, you spoke to that girlfriend today. Yeah, Chris, that girlfriend lives at the end of this block. Her boyfriend was struck right over here. The impact so hard that that no parking sign is bent over. And now she is overwhelmed with haunting memories of their final moments together when just yesterday they were planning a future together. The car just like came out of nowhere and then it just like hit him and then he like flew up. And then, like, flew down. In a split second, a routine walk took a deadly turn at West 23rd near Kelly Place. I need an ambulance. My boyfriend just got ran over. JV and Johnson lay motionless on the ground. Andrea Bentley rushed to his side. But I was so upset and shaken. Her boyfriend clinging to life when they had just spent the last year and a half of their lives side by side. Both seniors at Lorraine High School, both hoping to take each other to prom. It's really good boy. Don't know why anybody would hit him. He took a very special part of my life away from me. I'll never be the same. Just like Andrea, Javian's grandmother is also paralyzed with disbelief that he is gone. After all, the 17-year-old had just signed up for the Army yesterday. Wasn't even gone 10 minutes, and he got hit by a car. He was exactly walking right here. Witnesses tell me that car was traveling down the wrong side of the street when it hit this teen. The car had enough room to go over there. It wasn't like he had to go directly to him. They say it looked as if the driver meant to hit Javian. Now family, friends, and police desperately want to know who that driver is. Please just turn yourself in so I can have some closure. Witnesses describe the car as a silver Dodge Charger with tinted windows. They say they have seen the car in this neighborhood many times before. And if you have any information about this case, you are encouraged to call Lorraine Police. Live in Lorraine, I'm Kristen Volk, News Channel 5. Lee.